Today in Healthy Junk Food, I'm going to attempt to make a turducken. Make sure you like this video and subscribe, because without that, I will fail at this video. So you just kind of like gouge bones and meat out? I'm going to make you a turducken, you're going to be so proud of me. There are several reasons why I don't approve of this. One, we are having Thanksgiving somewhere else and someone else is already making a turkey. Two, a turducken. That's, that's really what we're making, a turducken? You're going to take three different birds and stick them inside of each other? That's disgusting. You're going to want to have a really nice, sharp, bony knife for this. You think that you can do that? Yeah, it's easy. Deboning. He bones everything. I mean, debones. <laughs> JP. Let's go to the butcher. And we made it to the meat house. Everybody subscribe for the JPs out there. Make how you pee. Just another episode of JP's making weird stuff while Julia doesn't approve. This isn't weird, You're is it? This stuff. isn't weird. It's very popular in Louisiana. Good job, JP. Mark's right there. He's ready to go. So he pulls it out. The, the turkey, not else. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do is remove the wing. Start from the back here, boning out along the breast. This joint right here, and that's the thigh. Chicken's done. It looks like a bird that wants to fly away. That's the duck, it looks like the chicken. If you can master the chicken, then the duck and the turkey are gonna be very similar. It's like health class. This is about a 19 pound turkey. 19 pound turkey? <gasps> I was like, ooh, Mark, cut me like you cut that turkey. That was weird. All right, guys, so if you wanna do this at home, don't. <laughs> this thing's ready. Hey, have fun guys, anything yeah. you need. Thank you. So we leave the butcher, and if I give you the direct timeline of what happened, we literally had to take the turkey home. JP. Stop. You hold it like a very giant purse. It's so time. You get it? Instead of go time, it's I'm sewing. Laugh. Oh, no, but it's not time to sew yet. You have to make the stuffing and the broth and all those things. Okay, just stick it in the fridge. There's no space. We had to get right back on the road and drive to the sushi place. The one that we did the giant bento box at. Our bento box. <laughs> There's no food in there. So we're filming there until like super late at night. Taco Bell. Inside the roll. We be rolling. We get home. I'm, I'm pooped. And I got a big ass turkey in the fridge. So it's Tuesday. We got to meet with some guy for an hour. I never saw that guy before. Oh. Sounds sketchy, it's not, don't worry. Then we filmed eating the entire menu at Arby's. Great, 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 great. Then I had to come back here and stuff my turducken. What are you doing? It's the best kind of stuffing. Oh my god, no, we gotta make it from scratch. No, we're not. It's ready in five minutes. How could you say no to that? It's kind of like making brownies out of a box. Yes. Slow it down a little. What? What? At least I get to see you do this. Cover and remove the meat. We have to cover it. This is a very simple recipe. Maybe you should practice with that a little bit. I don't think that thing works. Now this rub I'm putting on is a special homemade blend of cumin, mesquite, hickory, a little paprika. Don't do that. Oh. This is a 19 pound bird. I like that. It actually gives it a little breast lift. Yep. The stuffing's gonna dry it out. That way there's not too much moisture in the turkey. And I'm talking to you like I know this because we got a text message from Mark telling me to say that. Now we got the duck. So it's gonna go right down on the breast. Breast on breast. And everything's seasoned. Once again, I am gonna season the skin side. It seems like you know exactly how to do all these recipes. It's pretty good. I can tell by your posture too that you know exactly what you're doing. That is it. Time to put this <laughs> Right there in that cleavage, and then tucked right there on that thigh area. A little bit more in this thigh area. A little more stuffing down in the thighs. A little stuffing in the thighs. And then for the final, the chicken. It's a threesome of meats. And that is it. Time to put this thing together. Now it's time to put it together. I'm getting excited. But now it's the hard part. Now we have to sew this thing together. This big bitch of a bird. Did you make it really tight there at the butt? 
Is that the butt? How do I get it tight? So you just take this giant metal probe, pierce it into the skin of the turkey, and then you just sew like you would, at, you know, like, I know what I'm doing. I felt like I was in like a Saw movie, just sewing one of his contraptions to just like splatter in your face when you die. Seems like it wants to poop itself out. <laughs> together now. <laughs> you got this, GP. I'm a seamstress. <gasps> and I didn't have the correct needle, so I don't know if you can see this on camera, but I was using a, a nail. No one needs to know about that. We all made it out alive. I guess I should have waited at least one more day. Gotta give you credit, GP. You went all in. There it is. You're sending a picture to Mark? I've been sending him pictures throughout the entire time. While this sits and rests before tomorrow when it smokes, we are going to start our stock because we have all the bones in the rib cages and they are going to be the base. I love this part because you just get throw it, you just throw it in there, it don't matter. Alright, it's boiling, I'm gonna reduce it and cover. Boom! All these fresh herbs and ingredients, JP. I know. All this and then you put stove top in that. Why are you still hating on my stove I don't know, I just it just doesn't make any sense. No, it's fine. Dude, look at that. Have you ever smoked anything before? Yeah, I smoke all the time. I don't have a smoker, so I bought a discount smoker at the Home Depot. What have you smoked before? I've smoked salmon, I've smoked pig. What is all this? Read the directions, don't pull it all out. Men don't read instructions. We just feel what needs to be done and we do it. Yeah, you look like a man right now and not a child sitting on the ground, by the way. <laughs> I see your toys in the background. There's too many things. I have to assemble this? You want to know the easiest way to do this? Just read the directions. I gotta use screws? I got you this for your birthday. You never use it. You literally just bought it today. <laughs> it's for your birthday. My birthday is in January. This is your Christmas party. Does that mean I have to cook for you in it? No, I'll smoke all the things. So you're also gonna cook for me? No, I didn't say cook. Smoke. Oh, I have to do washers and all that stuff? I'm not putting washers in here. This is good enough. And we're finished. Uh-huh. Don't look at that. Oh, I didn't. JP, I think the door's falling off. It barely it, fits. It's, but it's perfect. Oh. Alright, JP, let's do your research. All we'll right. be back in the morning. You didn't throw my my food out, did you? Yeah, the Arby's? Yeah. No, it's right there. Oh, okay. Oh, yes. Okay. So, we wake up and we're off. We have to go to Badass Sandwiches. Julia signed me up to compete to eat a six pound, 24 inch long sandwich. That will be a video in the future. We can't stay long, because I got three birds in the fridge, all inside of each other, that need to get smoked. Further to the right. Further to the left. Nope, further back. Further that way. Today we're learning how to use a smoker, and then we're gonna smoke things, and hopefully not burn ourselves or light ourselves on fire. just has to soak in the water. You just keep filling this if the turkey gets too dry. Now, we gotta season the turkey. I burned myself. Now we'll just come back and look at this in an hour. It's time to make a roux. A roux equal parts butter and flour. Then we add our stock. And then you just season with some salt and pepper. And if it doesn't taste good, we got a backup plan. You could pour gravy on poop and it would elevate it. Oh yeah. This is only gonna thicken up as it sits here. Dude. <laughs> it's so good. You're not helping. GP, all you gotta do is go check the temperature. I'll go down with you next time. <laughs> Mr. Duggan's killing me. It's destroying my life. Not hot enough. Making a turducken is great if you have like a backyard, but when you don't have a backyard, it's not fun making a turducken. 
How do you get a smoker hotter? No! Another thing that people warned us about. It's all based on the amount of coal you have in there and the amount of wood and the smoke that's being generated. Well. Whoa. That looks awesome. Oh yeah. I don't know if you can read that, but it says 102. Yeah, so it's got another 60 degrees to go. What's your guess? For how much that weighs? Yeah. You said 32? I'm going to say 27. <laughs> 21 pounds! I'm making an elevated green bean casserole. I will use canned things in my recipe, but I will not use canned green beans. I will use real green beans. Julia is a casserole lady. Have you guys ever had green bean casserole before? Well, if not, make it this year. It's this easy. Careful, my turducken. It's four o'clock, we gotta do more. Yeah, I gotta make the mashed potatoes. Make a mashed potatoes from scratch. Plush, fluffy, pillowy. You did a good job, boo-boo. Is that how you made it? You lied to me. Yeah. <laughs> I hate you. <laughs> you made really good green bean casserole. I'm very proud of you. You didn't believe in me. Of course I believed in you. I just had to micromanage the entire time. It's for the crispy top. Party starts at 7. Bird's not done. Whatever. They gotta wait. And they did. They wait about an hour and a half. We take the foil off and the big reveal. This thing is gorgeous! Was that bird not the prettiest thing you've ever seen? If you're wondering why it looks so dark, it's a uh, Photoshop. I made it that way. <laughs> we want to start a new trend. It's called DIY Black Turkey. <laughs> the good news is the baby's not crying. Little mini J James Corden over there. Think about it, this turkey is definitely bigger than the average turkey. This looks like something from Blumhouse Productions. When you've been naughty all year and Santa puts coal in your stocking, you can also put like a black turkey in your stocking. All jokes aside, it's gonna be moist and delicious. Julia grabs a serrated knife and slices right down the center and then wait for it, wait for it, the reveal. You can still taste the smoke in there. That's awesome. I got the turkey with some stuff and it's nice and moist. It's very good. Oh, it's fire. There we go. Fire. Everything on the inside is super moist. So it's really, really good. This is how I'm afraid like the afterlife will work. Like I don't want to be a chicken stuffed inside a duck, stuffed inside a turkey. Like I bought Grey Goose beer because I was like, one more bird. Let's do it. <laughs> Make sure to find these recipe details at healthyjunkfood.com. If you guys like Fortnite and if you guys like Twitch, you have to know who Kyle is because Kyle is the best person on Twitch. And I go on the stream too. He's a work in progress. He's a work in progress. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I never had mac and cheese at a Thanksgiving before of you. Always. Really? Yes. Is that a southern thing or something? It definitely is. You gotta bake it so it gets a nice crust on top. So Sebastian, you brought something to this Friendsgiving. What did you bring? I brought southern style mashed potatoes because we're in the south, so you gotta have a lot of bacon in there and a lot of cream cheese and a lot more cheese. Oh my god, Thanksgiving is so different in so many different cultures. This is so fun. Thank you so much for supplying some food for this Friendsgiving. What did you bring? Publix mac and cheese. Really? You didn't make that? Oh my god, I thought everyone's like, are you kidding? <laughs> smoke on that was, listen, high five on that. The smoke on that was amazing. Everyone's eating all the turduck and I gotta cut some more. I already got it in my hair, that's how good it is. But yeah, people are really digging the duck. Obviously, the duck has got that sex appeal. This was delicious. It was seasoned right, it was cooked through. This might be the best recipe JP has ever Yay, made. Yay, thank you. I 100% approve of the turducken. What's next, JP? I don't know. <laughs> uh, hello, King Adrian. <laughs> King Adrian, oh Hi, man, Adrian. you brought me something? <gasps> we brought you a, a black bird delivered by a black guy. <laughs> <laughs> I like that. Listen, that's for you, man. That's sure. for you. Answer all the times I did you wrong. I love you. Yeah. I love you guys. I know you, guys you do. Are awesome. I know you do. I appreciate it very much. 
Yeah. Oh my God. That is good. Is that the first time you <laughs> played the fifth? <laughs>